none of us have been surprised at each of the promotions uh, that he got. We all would shake our heads and say, yeah, that's right. My ordination class was the first group he taught uh, after becoming a full-time faculty member at Mundelein Seminary. Uh, that's way back in the late 1970s. He was a talented man, but um, is more than just more than just talent. I guess I would call it the pastoral sensibility that he brought to everything he did. Even though he was an excellent administrator, he always brought that sense of how does this connect to the main thing we do as a church, which is the parishes. I'll share with you a story of when Wilton was little and um, it was nighttime and uh, my mother said, uh, baby, go and get the mop. And in those days we kept the mop outside on the porch. And he said, I don't wanna go there. You know, it's dark outside. My mother said, no, go and get the mop because realize God is everywhere. So Wilton goes to the back door cracks the door open and says, and I quote, God, pass me the mop. He's always been a sweet and a protective soul. He's always been a loving soul. And he's always been a person of deep faith. God works in mysterious ways, his wonders to perform. Our nation needs a healing. Our nation needs many voices to say we are all the children of God. We need to give each other the ability to celebrate who and what we are, where we come from, what we know, how we were raised. We need to realize that America is blessed with the children of every nation on this earth. That is such a gift. And we need people to say celebration time and Wilton is one of those people. Please click on the Archdiocese of Chicago Shield to subscribe to our YouTube channel where you'll find hundreds of Catholic videos. And for more great Catholic content, connect with us on social media.